can't believe it. There's no bits anywhere. Potentially every two-dimensional monitor that we use could be replaced by a holographic monitor. We are pretty much the only volumetric device that it has the quality that it has and is as close to market as it is. This is the Boxy Box. I've been working on uh, holographic and volumetric displays for about 30 years, and I've been working on this particular project for about four years. You know, you can get batteries for like five bucks on the internet, you know, from Amazon, for any phone. The Hall of Science approached me and I think it was 1985, and they said, can you, can you do this? Can you make a three-dimensional model of an atom? And I said, sure. The very first installation took up a room, was a series of optics and lenses and high-tech scanners that were able to deflect a laser beam at high speed, and that laser beam projected on a moving screen. And that stayed at the Hall of Science for about 20 years. The reciprocating style of display is is the display we're using now uh, for our volumetric display. We have uh, used it for playing games. You can see a CAD drawing with this uh, in three dimensions. You can spin an object around and you can see it in a way that you can't see uh, something on a, a two-dimensional monitor. I think I'm going to have to make... Oh, no, I think we're good. I have an engineering background. It's not formal. I, didn't, I don't have a degree in engineering. Uh, I've worked in offices doing uh, administrative work. I worked for a company that built cameras used in medical imaging. It did deliver uh, pizza very briefly. <laughs> I've worked mostly in my basement. Uh, that's where almost everything happens. Just thinking here <clears throat> about what has to happen next. The entrepreneurial road is very difficult. You sacrifice everything to, to make your dream happen. Sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't. So uh, it's hard to say with any uh, certainty what's going to happen. Um, the feedback we, we keep getting on our on our display is, is great. I mean, people just love it. So that's one thing that keeps us going is, uh, you know, the good feedback. We, you know, we think that we're going to be the ones to bring a holographic volumetric display uh, to, the, to the world. In the meantime, we keep re you know, carrying on research and we keep developing the device.